You know a few leaks? No. This has to be at least 15 bucks on eBay. Mm -hmm. Oh, she got cams now. <laughs> Alright, this time in Nugget Garage we've brought Barry. Actually, where did the name Barry come from? It's a barrel. Oh, yeah, Barry. that'll do. Barry's back. Uh, the yeah. 13s for 1300 Challenge car, we've brought that back out of the... Yeah, out Chris, of its Chris has been looking paddock. after it well. It's, it's got some patina on it now. It matches. Parked outside. It's not going in the shed. <laughs> so today I put some 1000cc uh, injectors in it and a Walbro 460. And we changed to E85. Um, and we put a boost tee that's worth at least 20 bucks on it. You reckon it's worth that much? Probably not. Yeah, I doubt it. No. Anyway, so the fuel injectors and the uh, fuel pump came out of the other 13s for 1300 Falcon, dollar Falcon. Um, that's about all that was left out of that car that was any good. Yeah, it, Scott ended up doing a deal and getting the car and it, it was... Mm junk actually it was worthless it didn't what for 4500 rpm and dropped a valve or something no it's just valve float yeah, valve yeah. Mounts or something it was horrendous cyclist I don't know where the build tab is at now. Still be under two grand. Oh, it would be for sure. Yeah. Not that it matters because the challenge no. is done anyway. So yeah. now it's just a shit box. That so I've gone and made changes to the map, set it up for 1000 CC injectors, changed the storage for ethanol. So it's 9.8, I think it is. So it should pretty much just start and run, more or less. So, um, and then we'll buzz it around a little bit, check all the light load stuff. Not that that matters really. No, because we'll this thing's never going to see light light. Oh, it does. It's got to drive up the return rate. It does. If and it makes it that far. We might set up a GoPro down here because this could get interesting. <laughs> to catch Rodney's. I don't really care anymore, so. Come on! Let's see how far it'll go. Kevin's a bit of a savage, so we need some power. You're not catching Kevin in this. Kevin's already beat it. We can try. Yeah, fair cool. Anyway, right, so. We'll this thing's on here, we're going to get into it and maybe hopefully not blow it up and uh, we'll see we how do, it goes. We'll get footage. Righto, tuna. What's the plan? So, I've sort of merged two maps together and changed it over to E85. So we're just going to buzz around a little bit, see how far off we are sort of in the light load cruise stuff, that should tell me where it should be under load. 
it's not doing too much trimming at the moment, so it must be pretty close. And then once I'm happy with that, I think we'll just squeeze it and should have the same boost in it still as what I had last time. I've just gone and lost my connection. the limit of boost. Yeah. If you put more in, I will lay money on the fact that Uncle Rodney is coming to visit. It's coming out. It's going to be all over. And there'll be no race for Kevin. Just need to see where we're going. What are you, what are you doing? Limits testing. I had a bit of timing in today. <laughs> It probably needs a bit less down here. It likes it. 
I'll make a change here to try and make it safer, and then we'll go and then leave it. Do one more run. One more run. Yeah. One more, he says. Just one more run. Oh, yeah. What are you doing, bro? Just looking at how uneven these pipes are here. What's going on That's there? It's horrible, isn't it? Symmetrical turbos and yeah. then maybe I should redo this one and make it go high as well. Yeah, makes sense, doesn't it? Yeah. Shame. That's just where it is then, isn't it? I've got the timing out down low, whereas before it had 24 freeway. And there was less timing overall too. So, so that should be safer than where it was. Make one more change. But basically there's about so five move. degrees less timing there. It didn't make much difference, so we'll But it better. won't blow up about here on the be. track. Shouldn't be. Hopefully. <laughs> Try once more and blow it up and see how we go. Did you just say one more run? I just want to trim that first bit, make it a bit leaner. Oh, here? Yeah. Could possibly go wrong. What are we watching this time? PFI speed. PFI speed? That's what they're doing. Uh, four wheel drive things. You're learning tricks. <laughs> hey, this is what happens, look. That's what we don't want? No, oh, not yet. <laughs> <laughs> So I'm not chasing how basically there's a little rich dip there, I'm trying to chase out of it. It's a little bit lean at the start and now that we've tried to make a number I'd rather it be a little bit richer at the track so I'm going to make it run say 11.6 to 1 not 12.0. There's still no intercooling so try and keep some fuel on the cylinder and keep it cool. And the biggest change has been making pull to pull is we've been taking timing away down low. And it's not really affecting how the engine makes power, so it's just adding safety, rod safety, which is probably still not safe. But it's probably not safe, it's probably still going to throw a leg out a bit, but... And that turbo is making boost higher where I don't want it to, and then it's falling away up the top, and I don't really want to put any more in the middle to chase it up the top. It so. just have to be what it is, then... But somehow the valve springs are holding in there. Yeah, which is odd. Maybe they've been replaced at some stage in the slot. And these, yeah. these injectors apparently were 200 bucks for six. And when closed loops trying to pull it back to 15 to 1 at idle, one of them one of them is not flowing. It's cutting in, cutting out, cutting in, cutting out. So I've tried to turn the um, closed loop off uh, at around 1,000 revs, so it should idle with an open loop. Hopefully. Hopefully. And that should get rid of that. The shitty, that shitty idle little misfiry sound and thing. And then Barry should be sweet. So just Not all bad, eh? Hey? Just one more. Just one, yeah. Just one more. Mm. Might be the end of Baz. What do we do if he blows up at the track? Or worse, here now, uh, in about five minutes. Clean it up and... We just, like, take off the... I'm taking my wheels from my van back. 
and go to scrap. He still goes somehow, which is surprising. I thought it was going to spit rods all over the floor many mm. times. But it's done all right. Mm. So we have sort of 12 pounds of boost in it as it comes on the boost. And then it falls away to 10, but we've got a manual boost too, so that's really all I can make it do. Um, it's rich there. We pulled the timing out. Made 450 odd rear wheel nearly. Yeah, 330 kilowatts for tyres, which is. What, 70 horsepower more yeah, than before? Yeah, because it was like three, it was 370 horsepower or something, yeah, so 378, something like that. Actually nearly 80 horsepower more than yeah, before. Yeah, so... Stalls um, up, does all that stuff. So it should just turn that into ET, I guess. Yeah, might, providing... Might be enough for 1190. Providing you get it off the line with an open wheel, I see. Yeah. There's a maybe on welding the might this hard to weld it. Lower the back of it. Change this front bumper. Make it look... Good for when it beats Kevin. It's not, it's not going to beat Kevin, mate. It's mm. not going to ever look as good as Kevin, and it's never going to beat it. You might as well just put it in the bin now. Well, I'm happy to do that. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Next time, we're going to take this one out, take Kevin out, race him. Um, I'm going to be driving Kevin. Or are you driving? Yeah, you want to get out faster on the oh, driver's and drive straight on the side of you. <laughs> it's all right. It's all right. I'll turn the nitrous on this time. Yeah. <laughs> It'll be done and dusted. Yeah, so we'll get them both out there and give them a run. And should be a pretty good race, actually. I think like, this thing's making... This thing won't win, but it'll be, it'll be closer than what it would have been. Yeah. Yeah, well, this is making, what, another 60-odd horsepower than, yeah. or 70 horsepower more than, than Kevin. But Kevin's got... Kevin's, Kevin's a lightweight. Mm. It's a bit like you and me, you know. You're like, going to start Kevin in second gear too. Yeah, so the lightweight's in the lightweight and the heavyweight's in the heavyweight. You can run with that, mate. Yeah. Can't fix ugly. <laughs> yeah, I'm good with being ugly. <laughs> All, right. All right, that's it. See you next week. Next week. Are blue. Now, I don't want to do that for. Pretty much. Yeah, good is it? 
Taxi spec. No, it looks like Barry's got a tuxedo on. Must admit, it does look better. Damn it. I hate it when he's right. <laughs>